Hello guys, welcome back to another video from Behind the Clutter. In today's video, we are going to make a basic water level indicator. And to make this project, you need some BC547 transistors, titanium resistors, few LEDs to indicate the water level, a zero PCB board to fix the components, and finally you need a 9 volt battery and some wires to power the circuit. So first let us cut the zero PCB into your required dimension. It's a small circuit so we need only a small piece. Now arrange the transistors on the zero PCB in such a way that the emitter comes on the left and the collector comes on the right like you see in the video. And solder all four of them in place. After that, arrange all four resistors in series with the collector pin of the respective transistors and solder it. Now arrange all the LEDs with their negative pins in series with the resistors. And also try to use the LEDs of different colors to mark different levels like you see in the video. That would be more appealing. Once all the components are fixed, connect them together like you see in the video. You can also find the circuit diagram of the same in the description of this video. So first connect the resistors to the respective negative LED terminals. Then connect the other end of the resistor to the connector pin of the transistor. Now fix a 9V battery adapter on the board and extend all the emitter pins of the transistor to the negative terminal of the battery and then connect the positive terminals from the LED to the positive terminal of the battery. Finally, extend the positive lines and the base pin of each transistor using some wires like you see in the video. And this wire should be cut with respect to the length of the water container and the respective levels that need to be indicated. Here I am using this glass beaker for demonstration. So I'll be cutting the wires with respect to different levels on this beaker. And finally the circuit is ready. Now all you have to do is to connect the battery and test it. So what happens with this circuit is that the transistor acts as a switch. And as soon as you give a power supply to the base, the switch will be turned on. And as normal water is a good conductor and we have already dipped a positive line inside the vessel, once the water touches each line from the base, the transistor will be switched on. So with that being said, this is Google Drive signing off. Thank you all for watching. Please subscribe to my channel for watching more videos like this. So see you with another one soon. Till then, bye bye.